All right, guys, here we are, Queen Anne. We're looking at this unit right here, 1507. Shout out to Tim Mangold of K-Dub for allowing us to do this tour today. Here we are. All right, so the first room here is a bedroom staged as an office. And we have the Mitsubishi mini splits throughout, which are really nice. Oops. Um, so this one's listed at 1.324. We have a closet. And then here's kind of your entry. And you do have a bathroom on the first floor. So you have your sink here. And then you also have your shower. Now there's no glass enclosure, so you'd either need to add a glass enclosure or you would need a rod as well. And it looks like this is a speaker, so they must have speakers kind of throughout the home. So you do have a one car garage. It's not super deep actually, but it's not too bad either. You could probably fit a car in here for sure. You have this little bump out that you could utilize for storage. You have your screens for the new house. And you have your electrical panel as well with room. A couple of lights. This probably has the 220 Rand to it. It just doesn't have the, the plug. That would be my guess anyway. And then you have this cool little bookshelf. All right, so upstairs we go. So this one has three bedrooms. That was one that we just got done looking at. And it has 2.5 bathrooms. They have like a lot of cool wood detail in this one. And so here we have the kitchen and the main living area. So Bosch appliances. This one is an electric stove top. So I'm actually not sure if there's actually gas on the property. We'll have to check. And then you can fill your water up right there. And then your pantry is probably gonna be set to be some of this. Oh, I'm sorry, that's not, not the pantry. I forgot this one. I think the last one I was looking at didn't really have a pantry. Um, but this one does have a pantry. You also have a wine cooler. And then you have quartz countertops with the island waterfall with eating area. So this really does act as your table. So there's not really a dining room here per se, that this is basically it for the dining room in this property. You do have the mini splits throughout. Stainless steel farmhouse sink. And then you have a Bosch microwave as well. Some cabinets.
Okay, so this is where the rest of the bedrooms are. So this first room here is the laundry room. So you would do a double stack type thing in there. This is your second bedroom. Full bathroom. primary suites over here. Black ceiling. This is like one of those smart mirrors too. There we go. Pretty cool. And then it does have heated floors as well, so that's what this is. And then here's the bedroom. Now the problem is that, that this is really the closet right here. And although it's super nice and high quality, doesn't really have a place. You'd have to take these shelves out to hang your clothes, or I guess you can just do it like that. So maybe that would work. I'm not really sure. I'm trying to think. For me, I don't think it would work because I would need more closet space. So here we are at the rooftop. You have your heat pump over here. You have your hot water heater. You can see downtown and you can see the Space Needle. Looks a lot cooler in real life, as you probably guessed. But yeah, guys, that's gonna do it for this video. If you like it, uh, if you like the tour, please give me a like, that'd help me out a ton. And please subscribe to the channel. And then before you leave, do not forget to check the description of the video as I have a special gift just for you. And until next time, guys, I'll see you in the next one. Take care.